okay, I'm, uh, I'm practicing, I'm checking to see if I can actually capture video. Uh, here are some of the things that I used uh, in early experiments to try to mount the video camera. This is a cowbell stand, um, which seemed like it would make a certain amount of sense, but it's meant to clamp onto a pipe, see? A mic stand or something, or drum hardware. So what I ended up using is this awesome thing called the claw, which I will show you, except it is here. So uh, I'm gonna unscrew this turkey. It's a Thanksgiving theme right there. Pop the camera off, and you can see that what it is is a very clever uh, universal mount. Here, I'll put the where our problem is is that the it's hard to just drop a camera somewhere and have it work. Uh, when you unscrew this, you can swivel this guy all around. Yaw, 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 yaw. And then this is a nice little clamp for clamping onto anything. And I just happen to have a tray here, a video tray. Um, it's uh, mounted to the... Uh, turn that off. Okay, it's... It's a, a table that you'd put a that you'd put a video camera on or a video monitor on, and uh, I put my lighting on it, and I put my uh, some of my video switchers and things, um, and sound cards and stuff on there. So when the claw is mounted on it, I'll just put the camera in my mouth here for a sec. Tastes terrible. All right, I'm putting the claw back on. Tell you what, I'll just sign out. You know, there are certain advantages to not having a regular mount for your camera. Anyhow, uh, we'll just call it quits and bye. Jerry, back to you.